116.85. That was our heaviest run of the challenge yet. 118 kilograms there. 119 kilograms there. 121.4. I, I like this challenge. This is fun. Bad. Storage rig though. All right, so we got a storage rig now. Let's see if Rishay is up. Hopefully, we can get some good PvP at dorms, and I can stock up on some rigs. Or Rishala as well. His guards have uh, black rocks a lot. scab with the door open out back so definitely someone has been in here they probably still are it's very early into the round they can be pvp doesn't oh it, it it's situational pvp can provide some really good loot A lot of times won't. Just a little hit bar there. I need his gear. Need that storage rig that he's wearing. Bring our gun inside. Yeah, it's. A little goofy. Oh. Needs to be third floor.
GG's boys. Have you always been better than Tom? <laughs> no, it is, yeah, it's always environment. That's funny. that to our advantage i think you can actually put this on like i don't know if that's it you can put a lot of uh attack devices on this and a scope and a foregrip which is why it's worth having and i think there's a better there is a better one actually i, I know there is because it's a single slot one that can hold more my armor did they patch this i can't i don't know probably not i'd imagine but it almost seems like they did because you can't oh no okay we're good i just had to crouch all the way the guy's gun was gold because it's enhanced Over 10, over level 10 weapon maintenance. If you repair through a weapon repair kit, you can get it to enhance. So we're at 69.6. We've got a lot of open slots. A lot of open slots. <clears throat> Might as well see what we get out of Mark. feeling getting to the uh, 100 kilograms might be a little easier this round. <clears throat> oh, and a clock. How much extra room we have? I'm about to just start picking everything up. What are these way in in themselves? Three. Okay, not maybe not maybe not everything maybe not everything. A seven point six. I don't think the car is up. <clears throat> I want to go over to two story. Oh, he took the car out. That son of a bitch. That's why it wasn't up. Oh, maybe he didn't hit this. I mean, you gotta download it. But yeah, if you pre-order Tarkov, you, you get to play it. Like, uh, right away. 93 kilograms. so much room
Yeah, I got both ammo boxes out of marked. Mm hmm. Four kilograms. There's a lot to loot second floor and then there's the safe as well. We can definitely hit a hundred this round. Scab walking to the south of us. And close that. That creates. So we'll do some uh, stashes on the way to extract. That way we can properly top off, uh, get rid of all the shite. All right, we got 10 minutes. Let's just get to extract because we got. As soon as I pick this up, we have over 100. Ready? Boom, 103.5. This one might be our chunkiest run yet. Nice. We also insurance frauded our helmet and armor. The two ammo boxes, they're like, what, four or 500k pop right now? Just those alone paid for the mark turn key pretty much. And then all the extra stuff, it's probably a two mil run at least. I mean, more considering we insurance frauded and got this like the helmet and the armor is like 375k, 400k. Customs done. That was a good one. That was a good one. I, I like this challenge. This is fun. This is the second time I've done it. The first time around was really fun too. The short, shoreline left as well isn't necessarily my favorite, but he, having this challenge does make shoreline a little more fun. 119. 119 kilograms there. Nice. All right, we'll pop that shit six off the start. Not the best spawn to get to resort before other players, but we can get there in a timely manner and we'll be able to hit a couple stashes on the way. Hopefully we get lucky and find some storage rigs in the stashes. We're only going to hit two on the way. Three, actually. Three. First up. All right, we're only going to hit two because there was supposed to be one in, in that bush, but it didn't spawn. It's cool to have a streamer item in game, but I don't think it's going to make like someone mentioned earlier having a streamer item is not going to make uh, People like you anymore Not gonna make you a better content creator So It's, it's nice though, it's, it's cool that they're doing it But I still think it's you know, it's uh, for fun and good content His planting is, uh, his SV-98. We got that now. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it, Project. There's 1,500 people competing in it. That I, very doubtful will I get it. I don't even think I'll end up in the top 10 just with with how much uh, luck is involved that it, it, there's gonna be players that end up finding the boss every raid end up finding the items every raid end up getting less populated servers and when they do get populated servers it's a bunch of Timmy's right like the stars are gonna align out of 1500 people the stars are gonna align for a lot of the players if I'm one of them then I'll try and capitalize on that moment but you know if I'm not it's no big deal because we're, we're playing for fun we're playing for fun And whoever does win it, hella deserving, because... Oh, we got Sandy up. It's like I said, with 1,500 applicants, you got, you're, you're going to have to play well. You're going to have to be on your game. And then when, if 
when you do get the opportunities, you're going to have to capitalize. Ah, oh, shit. I don't... I should not be down here. Yeah, I think we're good. Tank. I think I hit a lot of the railing, too. This is Sanitar as well. So it's this guard. Uh, Santar is tough to fight. Carry. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it chat okay listen listen I didn't see that that was the gun he was using that would have been a good play Oh my goodness, dude, I about did it again. Yeah. 
Listen, chat. Now I'm tired, okay? Second. Pack these and grab our store tricks. I think we're gonna hit the uh, I think we could do the 100 kilograms this round. I think there's still one more, honestly. I'm pretty sure there's still one up here. I think that guy had a duo. Maybe, maybe not, but I've had. Got a gut feeling we're gonna get killed by a third party. Or maybe not. On the plus side, we got Sanitar for overseas. This is the second time I've gotten him. I don't think we're gonna get this done this wipe, honestly, because I just. Not the biggest boss hunter. If we run into him, we'll get him though. Oh, X Mage went 100 kg, but it's basically 100 kilograms per map. This is the goal. And Alton and more ammo. Damn, okay. Another Alton. everybody 56A1 we're taking I'm gonna repack my mags with it and then pack a little bit of uh, MA55A1 I think that's everybody like 95.5 and we got another bag here with loot okay we're hitting 100 101.3 nice we did it Show you guys something super greedy too. And you'll be like, wow, what the heck? That's so greedy. And I'll be like, I know. That's why I'm showing you. Damn, 99.9. .9, what the heck? 99.8 now. There we go. 100.2. Gotta go to commonly extract camp to extract. All right, let's Leroy Jenkins it. Get the hundred kilograms. Hell yeah, I did. Hundred point two. Oh, I saw someone ask what was the most challenging. Shoreline so far has been the most challenging. 
It's the one I've died on the most with. Or... Yeah, died the most on. All the other maps were pretty easy, I'm not gonna lie. I think... They, they took one to two attempts on each of the other maps. Shoreline took like four or five. I don't play Shoreline much though. It's definitely my least played. Nice. 21.3k XP. God damn. Okay, that was a baller raid, I will say. Fun fights. We got Sandy as well. 114.6 kilograms on that one. 114.6. You see, it's my, it's the PC I'm using now um, with a better CPU in it. I've got the 13900K CPU. That one has the new 14900K. The new gen. Not a terrible spawn. Unfortunately, we didn't get the rusted bloody key. It would have spawned um, on that, like, tool bench. It's really coming down. Holy cow. Raining heavy. Good. Now you got a nice storage rig, some PP ammo. That's clutch. That's clutch. Big plus. Sniper scab shooting at me. Should be a PMC spawn up ahead to the right. I don't think getting storage rigs will be all that challenging on streets because we'll be able to kill a couple PMCs and probably get there pretty easily. I think streets is going to be one of the easier maps to complete as long as we can win our fights. Miss Duncan and I, when we were playing streets, we, uh, <laughs> like the past two days, we ran into so many PMCs in this back corner and we, we won every single fight. Just mopped it up. Oh, Kaban's up. Okay, perfect. It just, this is the one right here. I'm not even going to worry about this guy back here. We're, we're going to keep going. Especially with it raining, it's going to be kind of hard to pick up the audio cues on whether or not someone's there. But there is a PMC spawn back there and a lot of times they'll go up into the top apartment and start looting. So we can uh, catch them out there and they have to run down the alleyway. That's the only way out to that alley. We're going to skip over post office and I'm going to go straight for Kaban. If we're able to secure Kaban's kit and the guards, that should be more than enough to get over 100. Especially if there's any PMCs in that area. They'll have good storage rigs for us. Should be golden. Oh. Good gun fighting in check right now. Uh. What the hell? Hopefully this plays out well. Oh, that was fucking terrible, man. I got one more to try it. Okay, so Kaban's not up over here. Otherwise, he, we would have heard him and then he would have ran. We have the rest of the guards push us here. Should. So Kaban's going to be in the other, Le the main Lexus building.
see what we get out of this. Take the grip. I can aim okay. He's got a good storage trick for us. Take this rat off. I'm going to try and have a little bit of distance between me and these guys. And they go to push. Keep buying those, but let's say we got one creeping on us. either gonna immediately kill me through this or I'm gonna be able to immediately kill him come on red key card no it's still a good key it's like 500 and something K so that's still a good key Got the PMC over at. Let's get ammo. We got the PMC over at the that check building. Keep our ears peeled for him, but that's not going to be the easiest thing with this rain. I don't know who that scav's shooting at. I want to grab this guy's stuff really quick. Let's do this. chonky we haven't even gotten started grab 
grab all these guys' stuff. Okay. Yeah, I appreciate it, Titans. Let's go. A7.3. Yeah, we're, we're hitting the, the weight this round easy. As long as we can kill the PMCs. I don't think we'll have anything to worry about. 93.1. I want to get out of the Lexus dealership. Uh, fa abandoned factory key and, and we fill up. We get our 100. Okay, that should be the perfect amount right there because we should have another stack of 20 here and there. Yeah. Then we ditch this. Put that in there. Take you. Oh, wait. There we go. 101.1. Nice. Nice. Perfectly planned. Now we just have to get to the extract. And hope that that guy that was shooting outside our compound isn't going to bother us. Got 30.3k XP. That's nice. The only Kabana and the guards, great XP. Really, really good XP. 121.4. 121.4. I don't... I can't remember what the customs one was. That might be the heaviest we've been. Or customs is like right at it. All right. Let's go ahead and push up to this camp up here. We need extra storage rigs. Food and hydration items are going to be really good for weight. And can bring in a good profit too. And so we can look for those on inner or on woods. That's a really good one. We could get lucky with the goons, but it does not seem like they're up here. Ammo as well. Could be a good one. We're, we're going to have one big grocery shopping list in our bag at the end of this. Watch. It's crazy the amount of rubles you can make on just going for food and hydration items. They do sell well. At the very least, a lot of them vendor really well. And there's a lot of scavs on woods too. So we're going to have plenty of opportunity to pick up better storage rigs. Any 3x4 or 3x3 is going to be really nice. Grenades as well. They... they that's not a whole lot. But we'll grab it for now. I heard bushes off to my left here. Oh my gosh. Ow. I don't know what that was from behind, but I feel like it was a player on the consistency of the shot. So there's a spawn on the backside there that very easily could have been a player. Couldn't tell if that was him or not because the gun kind of sounded similar, but I think it was a bolt that was shooting at me. Did we go up top here? No. Okay, that guy we can drink. Yeah, the rest of this is good enough to take. All right, we need we need storage rigs from scavs. But there's plenty of scabs to kill. We could work our way back to... We could work our way back to um, the village. And potentially down to med camp. Med, med camp almost positive is going to be looted already. Alright, on to the next side. These two camps you can make pretty good profit from. The that one, it's okay. Um it's mainly like food and hydration items and some barter items from that previous one. These up here you can actually pull like a Ledex from. 
we go. Uh, yeah, it doesn't weigh much. You can get an M4 from this sniper overwatch there. It's a stock M4. Uh, maybe sometimes you can get the stop mod. I'm not 100% sure on that. We're 61.6. We, we, we're going to absolutely need the extra storage rigs. Risky there. I sh probably should have died, but thankfully missed the shots. I'm not complaining. Oh, he's actually got a better kit than I thought. Good storage rig too. We're gonna have to like trade ours up. Let's go down and grab our stuff. Hey, Mag's too late. I should have though. If you tag Mags, you can uh, write stuff on them, and then when they get it back in insurance, they'll see that writing. Just funny. Trolly thing to do, but funny. All right, so we're at 75. Not good enough, but we're getting there. We're getting there. I think now is where I pop the mule. We need to kill at least another scav to get a better storage rig. Hopefully two more storage rigs because we got these two. I want to replace the Tarzan and three, honestly, because I wouldn't mind replacing the diaper rig. It's zeroed, doesn't offer extra storage. What we could do is go back to the village since the car's still up. Car has 100% spawn rate, and there's gonna be scabs to kill there, plus uh, hopefully more loot. The village is pretty popular. There's two spawns outside of it, and even if people don't, even if they, the people that spawn outside of it don't loot it, someone else typically does. But that gives us a chance to fight a PMC, take their gear, and if there's not one, then hopefully at least we find a good storage rig. Then we can smack up some stashes. Hopefully finish topping, our, topping out our loot. Really, really need it. All right, so we're at 84.3. We will include the gun weight if we, uh, if that would be like the difference maker between hitting over 100, but I want to get at least 90 kilograms before we include any gun weight. Because right now with max strength, none of these guns or weapons weigh anything for me. And it's got 0.7, 7.3... 0.2 and 6.3 so like quite a bit of weight there and sick doesn't work if they're in backpack if they're in backpack it counts yeah it's it's I, it's the weapons that are on me so just these these four slots here see like 85.3 if i move that over so 85.3 i don't think we can take this guy we don't have any extra two by two slots Maybe take there we go. Ditch the helmet for it. That'll do. Okay, we got car still up, thankfully. That could have been bad. If car wasn't up, then we were gonna be probably in trouble. Yeah, let's peek our scouts down here. Hopefully they have a storage rig. One one with the two by two slots needed. We need to get the um Unka or whatever it is. I saw one with a two by two that offers one additional slot. Okay, we got it at 95. Let's 
good. She didn't mean to eat that. I need to make sure this guy's not taking the car out from me. If there is a PMC. I don't think there is, but there might be. It'd be green if he started to take it out. Take it out. The nade was the scav. The scav threw a nade at me. Ninety-eight point seven. I really want to hit this hundred. We're very, very, very close. We're gonna check like just this one spot here. We've already got well over it with the with our guns. With our weapons. Well, that's pretty much the same weight. Nine point one fuck. Devin, appreciate you, bro. Okay, whatever. You know, we don't, I don't, I'm cutting it a little close here. We're going. Got playing time. I know, but still. A little closer than I'd like. I'm just going to stand here. We're so late in the raid, like, surely no one is up. All right. First time in woods. We got, got it done. We'll add up the weight afterwards, but I mean, like, with just the knife alone, it puts us over. Or, well, I guess without, with the pistol alone, it puts us over. The pillbox won't offer it offers an additional row but it wouldn't let me take the uh it wouldn't let me take the extra storage rigs that i brought out so it would have been better actually yeah you're right because i had the um three by three rig that was only one extra slot so it would have been worth taking the pillbox you're right you're right 114 114.2 kilograms there all right not a bad spawn you got early access to the ps Crates. Gluhar is up. That audio is scuffed. It sounds like they're with us. Should push me here. Oops, I mean to cancel. Hmm. 
figured he was going to teleport through that door. I don't really want to enter from this side. We're going to, we're going to go up this way. Trying to go in on that side is not uh, ideal by any means. We're way too exposed to the K buildings and glue horror is already up there. So we're actually going to go over here on this side and go up into K buildings. That way we have hard cover right off the start. More play potential. Sounded like it, but he also might just be in front of us here. He just ran down. Okay, this one's pushing us. No, he also ran up top. No, he didn't. Okay. That's gluey. They'll push up on top of this guy, which is kind of rough. And I can't really tell if they did or not because of the audio. I think we're good. Otherwise, we'd be getting shot in the butt. Drop this in the corner real quick. That way we're not too heavy. Yeah, he's still over there. Someone just threw a grenade. Yeah. Fuck him up, Gluey. a bit dramatic.
One tapped him. Easy. Yeah, there should be a PMC around here somewhere that died. Scaps coming in now. Sounds like it's downstairs. Now that we got some extra storage rigs, we can go hit downstairs though. These rooms actually are hella worth. They're cheap. You can pull a lot of quick profit. I'm just gonna wait for one of these scouts to yell at me. Shoot through those cages, you can. Yeah. 83.4. We're close. Yeah, we're 88.1. We're close. We're really close. We need one more storage rig. And we'd have it. Looks like he killed a PMC. It's got a storage rig for us. Someone just hit Weewoo too. That can be my exit. Oh, he doesn't have a sorcerer force. This one though. Someone's coming to Weewoo too. I really want to camp the extract though. my back by the door. Yep. 92.6. Okay. We got it. We got it. that or we can do this guy yeah that's what we can do actually Yeah, I, I don't care. Oh, it's only two. Yeah, yeah, exactly. 250k is really a moot point for me, personally. There is a player scab there. There's not very many keys in there. And ones I really couldn't give two shits less about, truthfully. Makes you feel any better. There. Nice KD, like 2,000 back in the day when you can bring a bunch of cases in. It's gonna be close. I hope the Raiders don't get in our way. That'd be a pain in the butt. We good, we good.
There you go. 101.1. That was a good challenge. 20k XP. No PMC kills. We killed a couple player scouts. And then uh, Gluey. Getting Gluhar was, was clutch in that one. 116.85. That was our heaviest run of the challenge yet. This is actually a bad spawn. I don't know why I said it's not a bad spawn. This is a terrible one. Um, it's one of the three worst. You're very far away from the USAC camp. You, we could go contest Chalet, but we're pretty late to getting up there. Because there's two two other spawns that have higher priority access to us to it than us. Let's go for it. We'll hit. We'll hit it. This is, it's either that or you go to the USAC camp or the island, but I'm not doing the island for this challenge. The island's boring and too easy. It's free rubles and could very easily produce the 100 kilograms. Well, I think if we went to the island, we'd have to get a tank battery um, or come in with extra storage rigs, but I want to score the storage rigs in raid. I think we hit down here first because of the dead body in the uh, boxes. How's it going, who? Bank robber is an okay storage rig. You get two extra slots with it. And since it's a two by three, if we find two storage rigs that are three by three, it can still fit. The only problem with starting down here is pushing back up top. Could wrap right and try to go through the tree line. It's less direct of a path though. so far we go from the outside people like to camp this rock set here it's in between the two chalets or the hotel and the chalet very common rotation path so people post up and wait there Fragments anyway. 0 0.07. Not enough to want to take. I'm going to hold on to it until we actually uh, want to drop it for something maybe heavier. So I'm not looking for just heavy items. I want heavy item items of value. But let's say... You know, we, we get close to full and we go through the entire route and like there's no hope of us hitting the 100 kilograms. I'm going to still want that extra loot, the, the valuable item. So I'd rather hold on to it and drop it when the time calls for it rather than just like not pick it up at all. Well, like Minton's not super valuable, but it's like 20, 25k. So it's okay to have... This is a very low loot here. Usually there's a lot more rares. So yeah, they're just saving all the rare loot for the use that came for us. That's it. Two tank batteries. Yeah, Lighthouse is really good about producing the tank batteries too. But I'm not going to bank on hitting the tank batteries. Uh, we'll, we'll play it out like a normal round. GG's brother. And if we find the tank batteries, then nice bonus. We we got 
extra weight. If we don't find the tank batteries, then we can still potentially hit the 100 kilograms. And the lion helps, 7.2. but it's kind of a larger oh, mission failed kind of a larger storage rig but it does offer a little bit extra but I don't think it's going to be good enough so I might end up ditching it and just opt for the use set camp loot anyway that's what I'm going to do We're looking for three by four storage rigs, not four by four, because three by four or three by three makes it to where we can take out four to five extra storage rigs. Like we'd be able to fit more weight by taking a pick taking two storage rigs and filling those up than one M1 rig. Oh well. Huh. That makes it a little easier too. Bag? Uh, yeah, I actually didn't look for his bag. He might have had one. We're to 71.3 and no extra storage rigs and we're pretty heavy. I honestly probably could have grabbed that M1 rig and filled it up and that we would hit the 100 early before we even hit the use set camp. What we can do is ditch some of this stuff in here really quick, the heavy, the heavy pieces. I'm going to grab the rig and we're going to come back down. A little risky backtracking, I, especially on Lighthouse. All the maps, I, I really like running my routes and not backtracking. But we're going to do it for them one rig. Lighthouse especially, though, because it's a very one-dimensional map on you. Spawn south side, you work your way north. There's two spawns on the north side that might make, might work their way south, but pretty much the, the flow of the map is pushed north. there with the stuff in it go ahead and check this guy too so it doesn't really weigh much and we don't have a whole lot of extra room so i should end up dropping it you can hold it for now they were 84.4 if i drop some of the light stuff and replace it with something heavy then we can hit our 100 pretty quickly here we're getting close to wanting to pop our stem oh this has been looted dun 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 can't put on a gun? No, not the, not the gun we have. Hopefully the village hasn't been looted. There's a bunch of tech crates there that can give us some extra goodies. And then we replace what we have on us with those. Whenever you're dropping down something like that and there's, an, there's a... Um, a little bit of a ledge that you can like slide down, walk back into the object. You don't have to like walk backwards. I just do so I can actually see. As long as you're walking into it, be it frontwards, sideways, backwards, doesn't matter. As long as you're walking into it, you'll slide down. If you walk forward, you do the little like stutter step and you make a bunch of noise as you're falling down. It's so, like right here, walk left into the mountain and just slide. And we'll have, you won't have any fall damage doing that. 
right, nice. It doesn't look like it's been looted. The extras we have. I have um the obtusum going, which gives me a little bit of perception level. And that has put me up to max, so we have a chance to uh, instant search stuff. I also wouldn't mind trading out this Tarzan rig for a better storage rig, so we're going to take a peek at that scav. And we're at 88.8. .8. Not bad so far. Alright, so we're at 90. We're, we're officially over 100 with the uh, weapons. Now it comes down to whether or not we want to go to the use site camp and push for over 100. The problem with the use site camp is the rogues are likely already dead now that I think about it. Maybe not. But with how the uh, rogues are working, they all bum rush. So I'm honestly thinking we backtrack and hit path the shoreline. We were so late to the camp. We're so late to it. Yeah. All right, we reset. We reset. We regain stam here. We've we've got ninety one kilograms on us, plus another six point three and five point six, one point two. So like we're over hundred kilograms with the weapon. Yeah, we're gonna go back through mountain pass, hit two stashes, and we're out. Mainly because the new rogue mechanics on them all pushing one spot. It's it's extremely likely they're they're all dead or the majority of them are dead. Player scavs have all uh, scavenged through them. I also don't have a lot of propatil left, so once we run out of this next propatil, I'd end up having to just keep continuously heal, which doesn't sound very appealing. But they're off the turrets down there too. Yeah, I think we made the right call. So lighthouse completed on the hundred kilogram challenge. You lab also? Yeah, we'll be doing labs. Ninety-one point five. All right, so 91.5. We'll add it up after. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't go to the USAC camp. Too late to rogues, yeah. Mainly, one, they're probably already dead. Two, uh, the... I didn't have another propatil after that. And so we had one enough propatil to make it to the extract from where I was. If I would have stayed, I would it would have been me continuously having to heal, and that's kind of annoying. All right, so we got 91.5 kilograms. Plus, uh, what are we, five point, I need to break out the calculator. 104.7. 104.7 kilograms, first round. There we go. All right. Not a bad spawn that we had. Not a great one, though. There's not really any spawns on interchange that are, like, terrible in comparison to the others. There's some that are definitely better than others. But with max strength and endurance and an SJ6, we can get inside pretty quickly and be in a good spot to contest. We're wanting Ollie first and foremost because it's where a lot of the heavy items can be and we can pick up several fuel canisters or the uh, uh, motors and stuff. They, they weigh a de decent amount and they're good value. So Ollie is pretty popular to loot. There's a fuel canister. Boom. Ollie's pretty popular to loot. So we're going to want to keep our eyes peeled for opponents. Early wipe, it's really popular to loot. And then the motor. This is what we're looking for. High value items that got some weight to them. Helps with the 100 kilograms for sure. And what are the chances? The amount of water filters you can get back on this Ollie run is crazy. If you're looking for rubles, all, just sprinting through Ollie's pretty damn profitable. If you get a good spawn for it, like we've already pulled five or 600k here. Actually, maybe like closer to seven because we got what? Four? Okay, yeah. Probably like five to six hundred K. No, actually closer to seven. Closer to seven because the fuel canister is like 175 K. The water filters are going to be like, what, 125, I think, a piece. And then the other fuel canister is like 90. And then early wipe even more so because like these guys go for 100k plus early wipe. All right. 
We got some weight now. the positioning we're in because I want to put my legs back on we're gonna pop this and go back and get in this little square here I'm gonna drop the bag that way we can crouch and put our legs back on without uh being overexposed and obviously they're they're you know there's a lot of skill involved it but it's um with there being a lot of points on boss kills and um item points it's like someone's gonna get really lucky and have a boss every single raid others are gonna get unlucky and not have a boss for a single not a single raid so you know we'll, we'll see fingers crossed be doing it more for fun than anything that was a pmc killer is actually only top of the mall lots of sh scavs here Somewhere out of yeah i i can understand where he's coming from but if anyone thinks that someone with 15,000 hours played like Will, 15 to 20,000, needs any sort of help to find items, it's just kind of dense. So. People are going to be unhappy regardless. I, I'm... It's a cool thing BSG is doing for, doing for the community, and it's for fun anyways, so... You know, I'm I'm excited that they're doing it. We really need storage rigs. This has been a very quiet round too. As soon as I say that, you get the SVDS popping off. And we need we need a storage rig. This round's been very quiet. We could go get the guy that shot the SVDS. That's up and running more scavs. I think maybe kill us up, and that's why there wasn't any other scavs to spawn in. How'd your tournament go, Adam? On on dark and darker. could hit the back of Ollie as well. We could go out to power, hunt some scabs. That is not worth at all. But I'm gonna hold on to him just so we're full. And then once I know for sure whether or not we're gonna be able to make it, we'll just reset. Okay, 78.2. Have the nine. If we get another storage rig, we could do this actually. Oh, I saw a sledgehammer. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. Now, if we ditch some of the lighter stuff, I think we can do it. There we go. One, that's another storage rig there. That's not the best one, but it's an okay one, and I think that can push us over the 100. We'll have to move the fuel canister into our bum. Grab this and then we can fill up and look to bounce. 
flashlight as well. Oh, and we have plenty of room in here. room for a serve that's fine though that's fine that's fine okay yeah, we're at 91 so we're officially over 100 now with the uh with the weapon weight let's see if we can top it out over 100 93.7 we can do it we can do it all right now we trade out some of the super light stuff the USB plug, I don't think it's worth much. Like, that's the goal. I want I want to try to grab things of value, not just things that weigh a lot. Obviously, we want to try and do both, right? I check this player scav. He came from the backside of Ollie, so he could have something good on him. Plus the extra uh, weapon weight, we are actually at like 10 there and then another one there and 0.3. So we're at like 112, 112 kilograms right now. We'll do the exact calculation at the end. Now we just gotta get out. We're gonna worry about the extra campers. Does it include weapons? No, because I have max strength. Max strength does not include the weapon weight. Not gonna lie, I don't really trust going to Emercom. My least favorite extract to go to. So what we're gonna do instead is take the other one. Zero to hero, 100 kilogram challenge. I'd be open to do that in the future. I'm gonna try and get this done in one day here. That one would take a few more days, I'm sure. I'd be open to that challenge though, for sure. Wait to regain some stamina here. Six and a half minutes. Plenty of time. Oh, we were low on that. Glad I checked it. A little bit of a stretching. All right. My favorite run in all of Tarkov. Let me grab my stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm so chonky. Spend everything. Just check and wait. Oh, we got the PMC off the start. Boner Garage. What a name. It's a kilogram challenge. Yeah, 100 kilograms uh, per, per map. Minus factory. Factory is going to be a bonus at the end. All right, so 100.2. I'm going to do just quick calculation on how much it actually is. 112.2. 112.2 there. Do you, have, you have raiders start to walk out. There's a lot of nades going off. There, he saw me. I should get him to push forward. Yeah. Oh my goodness, dude. Hopefully he doesn't headshot me here. Hey. 
She's downstairs in the basement. There should be another raider by the one that kicked the door open. <clears throat> see what ammo we have here. Look at ammo. Check some of these barter spawns. Probably upstairs. Now that kind of scared me. What's FMJ MO sell for? I don't know. Andrew Wick. Uh, it's not worth a whole lot, which is why I'm not taking it. Looking more for items that bring good value. It wouldn't be bad though. Like there's one down low here. Which I can't. I, if I run down those stairs and they see me through the stairs, he's he's gonna drop me so easily. Not enough cover. He did. Oh, he's calling the elevator. What if he's trying to leave? Surely not this quickly. I think he did leave. Match up in jail? Okay. Worth taking then. So one of the guys left. We still have the guy. We got the yeah, bunch of raiders over here. We still got the guy over by parking. Go back this way. Back this way and push up top. Let's see if we can't find EMC that was shooting over here. My arm. Buddy didn't headshot me. Heard running over here. That guy could have called the elevator down and then sent it out to try to. Bait. One tapped him. That kind of scared me. Heard metal and walking over there. That's why I initially went over there to peek. We had a couple different sets of raiders up. I just don't know where at exactly. I'm gonna close these doors. Because there's not a whole lot of audio that, of the metal stairs there until they get to like the top. Oh. That PMC. So it's nice to have the doors closed. And that way, if they do walk up, you all you have a chance to actually hear them. You don't have too long, but at least a little bit.
Guess when this guy died to the raider that I ended up killing. I cast him for you, man. Mm, don't think that raider had that. Step on back in. A little bit wider of a step. We're gonna run across. Nothing. Checking between the vehicles. Nothing. You need a Ludex right there. And back we go. Door. I'm getting tired. Rogues always spawn. The, the raiders on labs? Yeah, they, they'll always spawn. Uh, rogues on lighthouse? Also always spawn. We might be alone now. So I'm be a little careful. But we might be alone. Because we did have that guy. He broke that glass. We did have the guy um, call O and then leave the elevator. But people will do that to bait. Lull people into a false sense of security. And then we heard the other shot over by parking. And we found that guy dead. Should have raiders in the middle here. Check mini med. The loot lord plushie. Blood set. Not bad to have in terms of rubles, but they don't waste shit, so we're not taking it. Oh, there we go. Got running to my right. right here as well and where I got that raven I think they went into anger I heard movement over here I don't know where we have that guy that's still loot Yeah, I think I heard him right there. Draw my bag so I can move a little faster. Yeah, there he is. I would have assumed there would have been more than just the one. Maybe not. Check inside here real quick. Nope. Go for max weight. Yeah, 100 kilograms per map. This is the last map. Oh, this guy's got an ABS. Nice. Yeah, Sam, it's got that red strip at the bottom. We don't want it. I'm going to hide my bag really quick in here. Hopefully this time we don't get shit stolen from us. You pass? Oh, actually, yeah. Where did I pass it? I hate quiet labs raids. I'm gonna check up top here. There they are. We're gonna go this far side and up. Anyway, we got a little bit of hardcover to play off of. He got shot like right above his head on that first one. Shouldn't have went for the repeat. That was too. Back. Ooh. Enough time to put this arm back on and still loot. Just need to deal with this guy. Again. 
What the fuck, dude? This dude is a creeper. Oh shit. See why the guy left early. Missed out on quite the firefight down here. We don't have a whole lot of time. On to it for now. I'm not sure which one's gonna weigh more, or if, if it's gonna put me over the 100 kilograms. The Redut does weigh a lot more, but the Corand I actually want to use for a barter. Whereas I really wouldn't use that Redut, I'd just sell it. I do barter the Corand for Defender 2, yeah. FMJ flea market, so well, it's like 400 and something rules, so not bad to have. Nice, 100.8. We don't need the redux. We still got a little bit of room. It's not really a whole lot extra that I want. All right, fuck it. Good enough. Good enough. We we hit our hundred hundred kilograms. I'm happy with that. A little low PVP round, but I'm not complaining. There we go. Hundred point. Hundred five point eight. I think I missed a slot in here. I did a few slots. Okay, it's fine. But we can take the armor now that we done and sell it. So I'm okay with that. Yeah, not bad, not bad. So we, we hit the 100 kilograms on every single map today. Besides factory. We'll do that as a fun one. Uh, extreme. That's a meh raid. But still got the 100 kilograms. 118. 118 kilograms there. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. That that that's a good one. I'm happy with that one. And right about the time that I normally end anyway. So that works out perfectly. Hell yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for all the support today. 